Hi folks, this is Sue Bell from NetworkEmpire.com and today I'm going to show you how you can take existing pages and posts and use one of our silo plugins to create a silo structure from those existing pages and posts. So I'm going to start at the absolute very beginning and come here to pages and just make a few new ones. So I'm going to pause this video while I make these pages. Okay, so now you can see I've got a couple of pages. I have a home page, smart pa smartphones, and a smart scales page and now I'm going to come up here to posts you'll see I don't have any posts and I'm going to make some new posts and I'll pause this and be back in a second okay so now you can see that I created a couple of posts and I created a couple of categories and it just so happens that these categories match the pages that I made, but they don't have to. You don't need to worry about your categories. That'll all be handled automatically by the plugin. So now I'm going to go to the plugins page and I'm going to activate. I'm just going to activate Simple Silo. It's the same process if you want to do this for either the Deep Silo or the Video Silo Builder. You would just add an, two layers of pages and then the posts underneath that. The advantage of the Simple Silo Builder is that there's only one layer of pages and then the posts are right underneath that so it makes for a faster demonstration here. Alright, so the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go find the pages that are going to be my silo landing pages and I'm going to edit each one of these in turn. So start with the smartphones and I'm going to come up here and it's going to say not in silo. So the only option at this juncture is obviously for it to go under the home page. So I'm going to say under home and I'm going to update and that's going to create the silo structure with that being the first silo. So now I'm going to go, that was smartphones, I'm going to go to the smart scales and I'm going to edit that page and I'm going to put this also in the silo. So now I've got two silo pages in my this isn't going to actually change because it had the categories up there before, but trust me, if we come here to the manual silo builder, now you'll see that we've got um, that we've got the silo landing pages. Now, it sees these as being under there because they were under the right category to start with, but we still need to add these into the um, into the actual menu. So I'm going to come here to the posts to all posts and I'm going to edit these and put them under the right silo. So it says not in silo. This is um, phones, strokes can be prevented. This is about this, the um, phones that monitor your heart. You, and I can tell because that's in the smartphones category. And update. Now, if this needed to be in a different category, the, the silo structure will take care of that and update your category appropriately. So um, so now we want to go back to all posts. We want to do the other one. This was the 90% one, the BMI. We're going to edit this. We're going to put this in the right silo place in the scales. BMI into the scales. And so now our structure is actually set up and complete. And if we come in here and into the manual silo builder, um, it doesn't actually look any different, but now everything is actually part of the silo structure. So, having said that, um, the last thing that we need to do is make sure that we've got the menus set up properly, because it looks like these menus are duplicated. So we come in here, we come down to probably here and probably to menus, but it might be a Genesis thing that I need to turn off. If this isn't like super simple, then I'm just going to ignore it. Primary, let's take the second one and just say select a menu. And that should fix the menu bar at the top. And that got rid of the duplicate menu bar. Now it looks like the, the widget was already added over here, but let's just go take a look at it. How you would do that is you come here to widgets, and because I use this blog all the time, it's probably already got that widget in here, but if it didn't, I would just put the simple silo menu widget in the sidebar, and that's what makes these things show up here. Related articles, you can see I've called this related articles. I can change this to stuff, and that will change this title there to stuff. So that's what that menu looks like there. And, um, yeah. 
that's it that's all there is to it that's how you take pages and posts and you put them into the silo structure you just edit that box up at the top and save it and Bob as they say is your uncle thanks everybody this has been Sue Bell from Network Empire <laughs>